Good morning. I have broken nails, not from furniture. They just came off. <laughs> not from putting the furniture together. I've got, I really didn't do much. Brandon did all that. I was folding some clothes. I done broke some nails. My hair is not, well, my hair is done. My hair's literally braided, but my hair's not out of the bonnet. But good morning, y'all. Me and Rue have just been chilling in bed this morning. We woke up, we had a delicious breakfast we had pancakes eggs sausage um and then we were just chilling in bed but i have been nesting so bad like you guys literally so bad before we get ahead of ourselves hi welcome to the vlog if you're new welcome if you're not new welcome back um but yeah i've been nesting so bad and i got really sick the last like two days days like yesterday and the day before and i still was like brandon we need to get this furniture put together we need to get this furniture put together i don't my due date is not until july 7th and today is april 5th so why am i freaking out i don't know but the nesting is very real the crib will be delivered saturday and then that's all of like the big furniture that we bought we're probably we're gonna need a new changing table too. I thought the changing table we have now will work, but the dark the dark gray is clashing with the light gray and it's driving me crazy. So it's gonna have to go. But we will talk furniture updates and like bedroom decor updates in a little bit. Right now we're about to fix my nails. Uh, uh we're gonna fix my nails, do some new nails. Maybe do some new lashes today. That's that's the goal for right now. After I do my nails and maybe my lashes, um, I'm gonna show you guys all the Amazon pickups that I've got up, that I've got delivered lately. I can't talk. Um, our furniture came from Amazon for the girls' rooms. And then the stuff I got for my vanity. I got some like vanity organization stuff. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna show you guys everything that I bought. We also can do a baby clothes haul. I found the jackpot for baby clothes. So for my mamas, my expecting mamas, my people who know expecting mamas, or if you wanna have kids in the future, I'm about to put y'all on, okay? I got so many baby clothes and you guys won't believe the price. So let's work on some nails and maybe lashes. I'm saying maybe lashes because I'm afraid to like, Ah, I'm just scared to jump right into lashes because lashes can take long, but I'm about to do my nails. I do have the TikTok viral nail glue to try now. I showed you guys this a couple of vlogs ago. I have not opened it yet, so it's going to be my first time trying it. And yeah, let me see what press-ons I want to use because I have a bunch of press-ons. I think I want to do this pink. Oh, I forgot I had these. I'm going to do these. I have this pink French tip. You guys saw me do these before. I love them. And then I have this light pink French tip, but I think I'm going to do these. They're just like a fade, like kind of like an ombre nude white, and they have glitter at the base of the cuticle. So I think I'm going to do these. Which one? I wish this was live so somebody could answer me. Which one should I do? Pink French? Mm. Let's do these ones. Look at her. Look at her, mama, man. Look at her. 
That ain't my, that ain't my girl, that's my nigga Catch me out on ocean vibes with her Ay. Catch me in the whip, ride with her Ay. Sipping something, bumping big, hypnotized with her Pray you get that job in Tampa That's only four hours away Take a car, take a plane, baby, whichever is faster oh. I did my nails and I painted Aurora's nails So, I don't have time for lashes today I'll do my lashes on Sunday. Why well, can't get my hair tie off this bonnet? What the hell? Yes, my nails are done. I used the TikTok viral nail glue this time. You guys know I was using this glue, which did me good week and a half, two weeks. Um, I'm gonna leave this in my bag now because I know this nail glue is bomb still. If the TikTok viral nail glue lasts as long as people say it does, people say it'd be lasting in like 30 days, then this will just be the nail glue that I travel with. That way, if something does pop off, like if a nail does pop off, I will have it with me. Because the TikTok bar nail glue is like pretty like big to travel with. Um, but nails done. My brows have not grown back like crazy yet either. So that is great. Before I show you guys the room updates to the girls' room, before I show you guys the room updates to the girls' room, I want to show you guys the stuff that I purchased for my vanity. So a couple of vlogs ago, like like many vlogs ago, I was like reorganizing my vanity, didn't really love how it looked. Um, and I wanted to display some of my perfumes at and like on my vanity as well. So I was like, I just need to get like a little like mini vanity shelf. Like it, it, it just wasn't working the way that I had things. I also no longer wanted my makeup, like my makeup collection to sit on top of my vanity. So I found a solution that works perfectly for me. Everything I'm about to show you guys, I will have linked down below. It is from Amazon. I got this little cup for my brushes so that I don't have to have my entire brush caddy sitting on top of my vanity and taking up space. These are the brushes that I use on a daily basis. So I have those sitting here. And then on the right side of my vanity, I purchased this shelf. Um, I have a picture of like what the listing looks like so you can get a really good view of it. But this is to display some of my perfumes. And yes, I just love it. I think this is the perfect solution. This is exactly what I needed on my vanity. And I'm very excited about it. All right, we're about to go into the girls' room. Um, so, I like I said, I have the baby's crib coming on Saturday. Their new dresser has been delivered. Um, their new toy storage has been delivered. Their toy storage holders have been delivered. I'm about to show you all that. We moved Aurora's bed where it will be. Um, and we also got a bassinet. I'll show you guys that. And I got a car seat already. So we're, we're, we're doing good. I've been shopping like crazy. But anyways, um, we're getting rid of the changing table because the gray does not match. And I'm moving away from the dark gray and black for their room because their room was like dark gray, black, pink. I'm moving it to light gray, white, and pink. So all the dark grays got to come out of there. The dresser that's dark gray, got to go. The changing table that's dark gray gotta go so aurora has been playing a little bit today so don't mind the toys on the floor but this is new toy storage love that aurora's bed was over here now it is going to be there the changing table has to go because it is dark gray and we are getting away from the dark gray this is their new dresser perfect with the white and the light gray these are the colors we're going for i'm unsure yet if I want to keep this in here, still deciding on that. We will see once the crib gets in here on Saturday. The crib will go here. All of this is leaving. All of that's the bassinet, so that's not leaving. The bassinet will go in our bedroom, obviously. This is getting out of here. This is getting out of here. That can stay because it holds her um her dress up toys. But this is these are the new vibes: the light gray and the white with the pink. So I got, let me lift this. I got the bassinet from Facebook Marketplace for $30. This bassinet retails for $200. I got it from Facebook Marketplace for $30. Brandon and my mom and one of my sisters was like, girl, you buy all this stuff off Amazon, look on Facebook Marketplace. I looked on Facebook Marketplace, got my bassinet for 30 and brand new car seat. I mean, brand new never used like completely it was collecting dust literally 
$30. I'll show you guys that when I get my car. I've been so busy, like shopping, appointments, all types of stuff. I haven't even opened up this bassinet to see how big it is, what it looks like. So I'm gonna do that real quick. Like nesting will have you crazy like that. Like you'll be going so crazy. Like I have to, I have to get this, I have to get this. And you get it and you're like, okay. Like I haven't even opened this bassinet. And I love that it folds down. Does it just snap up? How do you click it up? How do you click it up? I'm so confused. Oh my gosh. It's getting so real that I'm about to have this little baby in here. It's all too real. It's all too real. So crazy. And this is a great size. And then if I want to like go downstairs with her, I can just fold it, walk it downstairs. Oh, my baby's coming. Okay. <laughs> all right, let's fold it back down. How awesome. And then in the new dresser, all of Aurora's shirts are in here. Her bottoms are in here. These are her other bottoms, like non-jeans jeans. Socks, undies, bathing suits, hats, leg warmers, and PJs. Over here, the baby has sleepers and um, like receiving blankets so far. These are all of her onesies. I bought these all in one day. Don't worry, I'm about to put y'all on. These are all of her shirts and onesies. And she has literally no pants. Like, I realized that upon leaving, I was like, okay, so I got all these tops. My mom bought her two skirts, great. And then some jackets, and these are matching outfits. So the Thrift Baby Store, Once Upon a Child, they have clothes, tops, bottoms, shoes. Uh, they have cribs, bassinets, car seats, all kinds of stuff. I'm about to put y'all on, listen. You can get 20, two zero, 20 baby onesies, any size, for $10, y'all. I acted a fool. I went so crazy. I was like, this is a steal. I will be going back in a couple of days to get some bottoms as well. updates but hold on real quick before we get into furniture updates crib updates because y'all know the crib was supposed to arrive today before we get into all that i have that feminine urge to take a picture of myself from the front from the back and from the side to see what i'm shaped like um i've seen other girls talk about this too like when you look in the mirror the body dysmorphia just kicks in and you don't know what the frick you're actually shaped like and being pregnant is really throwing me off I don't know like some days I feel thick some days I feel skinny I think realistically I'm somewhere in the middle Ugh, my mouth is so dry my mouth is so dry it is 6 42 I just got home from work not just but I'm home from work um I work nine to five on Saturdays hate that I, I also changed both of my back tires before I got home because we are going on a road trip to North Carolina to go visit Brandon's family. I am so excited about it. We're leaving on Tuesday. Whatever. That's not what I'm, that's not what I came to talk about. Um, Y'all think I'm shape bad? Okay, Aurora is asleep behind me, so don't even mind that. But, and I spilled barbecue sauce from Popeye's on my leggings and they're dirty because I was sitting on the floor at work. Whatever. Am I shape bad? I feel like my butt is getting bigger, but it's not sitting up, it's sitting under. And I don't like that. 
So I'm like, do I need to go to the gym? Like I would go to the gym. <laughs> That's a joke. <laughs> That's so funny. Why would I go to the gym? If y'all don't know, I am not a gym girl. Like me suggesting that I go to the gym even for a second is really funny. Anyways, um, the crib came. I'm so I'm so like all over the place. But the crib came yesterday. So when I came home from work today, let me tell y'all something. My baby daddy was working today. The crib is put together. That dark gray changing table, out of here. We should have. <sighs> I should have told you to take pictures of it, babe. We should have kept it and put it on Facebook Marketplace for $50. Which one? The changing table. No. Somebody would bought it. I told Brandon, if you want to keep this dresser, do whatever you it's want. Different. Good. I told him, because he was like, I can keep it for my clothes. Sure. Do literally whatever you want, but it cannot sit in my girl's room. <laughs> and the dark gray was throwing the vibes off so bad. And now I'm going to show y'all what it looks like. It looks so good. Brandon, don't you agree? I think it looks like a uh, little girl's room. Or, you know. Yeah. A set of girls. It look, but it's nice though, right? Like yeah. the colors are complimentary. It's do you classic. see? Do you see what I was going for? It's classic. Yeah. He thinks it's boring. <laughs> he thinks it's boring. That's what he's saying right now. <laughs> he says it's boring. But it looks really good to me. Um, I'm about to straighten up in there and put the rug down so we can like see the the what, what vision. Rug Her pink rug. I bought him a pink rug. They don't need that right now. They do need. Put that down when you get rid of me. Like I'm gonna get rid of my cat. Anyways, <laughs> anyways, let's talk about this hair because I'm about to travel. So we are going to North Carolina. Like I said, I don't think we're leaving on Tuesday. Today is Saturday. I don't think these braids are going to do it. We're going to be there Tuesday to Thursday. I just feel like they're not neat enough anymore. Like they, they don't look new anymore. They don't look bad, but they don't look new. Brandon don't want me to have a blowout. Brandon thinks I should either wear my natural hair or have braids. I want to get a blowout for the week and it's not going to last more than a week. And then I want to get boho. I want to get knotless boho bob braids. So yeah, that's what I want to do. I also have to do my lashes tomorrow because we're traveling. And I don't want to have to worry about wearing makeup while I'm there. And if I just do my lashes, and I might even tint my brows so I don't have to wear makeup Tuesday. Wednesday? We're leaving Tuesday night, right? After work. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Wednesday's the tent. Mm-hmm. So yeah, those are the vibes. Let me show y'all the room. The reality of having kids. <laughs> no clean walls. None ever. Happy Sunday, girlies. I waited until today to show you guys the room because I wanted to clean the room and I wanted to like show you guys the room in the daytime i am coming at you in the middle of my sunday reset which will be a separate video but i want you guys to see the room clean in the daytime really catch all the vibes you know what i mean so let me show you what we're working with so here i am standing at the door frame this toy storage will be leaving we're going to replace this um but the pink rug will go in the middle this is the dresser. Like I said, I will have the dresser linked down below. I'm gonna get these stickers off the wall. Her bed is not made. This is also not her bed spread. Um, we're doing pink and gray bedding for obvious reasons. <laughs> Toy storage is up. I will have these linked down below. They came in a pack that was really inexpensive. One, two, three, four, five, six. So that's really good. And here is the crib. We are going to clean the walls, don't worry. Aurora has done a number on the walls but we are going to take care of it, okay? Because I'm getting this room together. Um, this basket will be replaced also. That just has her dress-up toys. I mean, her dress-up clothes. That's gonna be gray or white or pink. But here is our crib. We went with a mini crib this time. We're probably gonna order a mini crib mattress because the little mattress pad that comes with this, I mean, it's pretty thin. Um, we'll see after I put a mini crib mattress sheet on it, uh, but this is our mini crib. I will have a link down below because this crib was so inexpensive, but it was the exact style, exact color that I wanted. So I didn't feel like by going the inexpensive route, I was like missing out or sacrificing. This is exactly what I wanted because as you can see, it perfectly matches 
Aurora's existing bed. The nesting, the crazy nesting mama in me is really happy because more clothes, diapers, uh, bottles, tummy time mat, and like a little sling baby carrier. And then we're pretty much done. Like we really don't have that much more to go. Um, which makes me really happy. I am 27 weeks today, so I am officially entering my third trimester. And it, like, I finally have the peace of mind that I've been needing. And my nesting is starting to, like, calm down because I'm like, okay, if baby comes right now, not gonna be like, oh my God, you know what I mean? Like, I, I don't know, I don't know. I just was going crazy about it. I'm so grateful that I have a partner that listens to me and isn't like, oh, we can wait, we can wait. Like, he was saying we can wait, but he was like, if you feel like we need to get it done right now, even though I feel like it can wait, let's do it. Let's buy the crib. Let's buy the dresser. And uh, I'm just so appreciative. I'm just so appreciative. But thank you for watching this very nesting vlog. Thank you for watching. I am currently filming a Sunday reset. So the mess behind me. Yeah, don't worry. I'm going to get to that. But I will see you guys in my next vlog. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. Mwah.